Crystal Guys, Beyond the Forbidden. I recently interviewed Jimmy Roberts. You can go to his YouTube channel, The Real Jimmy Roberts One. That's The Real Jimmy Roberts One. I'm about to show you a video clip within the full length interview that I will post on my YouTube channel, Beyond the Forbidden TV, in the near future of Jimmy talking about Comet 67P. He talks about this comet being an artificial morphing machine. It is mind blowing. I promise you will not be disappointed. But anyways, go to his YouTube channel, The Real Jimmy Roberts One. Make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell for future updates on any videos that he uploads to his channel. And drop them comments below and enjoy the video. Okay, this is Comet 67P, and we'll just go through this real quick since we're running short of time. Okay. Every one of those. This thing was discovered back in the late 60s by uh, a couple of uh, Russians. And um, they thought they had discovered... Actually, they thought it was another comet and realized, oh, it's a new comet. They discovered a new one. Well, they were right, except it's not a comet. Uh, they realized it was going to hit its closest path to the sun back, oh, that was several years ago. So back in about 2004, the European Space Agency lost the, uh, launched excuse me, the Rosetta mission to uh, go explore this thing. A few years ago, it got there. Every one of these images of the same comet. Now you tell me, how does it have all these different looks? It's ridiculous. Um, mm. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you quickly. Well, that's me talking about it one time. That's actually the model they've made for it. That's the model they made out of all of these. Well, there's something wrong here in there. Let me, show you, what, let me show you what this thing really is. Oh, first of all, let, let's show one interesting image about it um well i'm i apologize that's not the one i wanted to show i think i wanted to show this one okay <laughs> if you notice most of the images from it really look like an animal no mm -hmm. matter what direction it's going you're going to get an animal out of it with a neck or whatever or legs that's our imagination is it well <laughs> look at this it's a drill why is there a drill I mean, that's a drill. About three football fields long. This comet wow. is about two hundred, uh, about two and a half miles by close to three miles length and width, depending on what it's shaped like. And look at where this thing. What is this down here that it's pointing at? What What is this? I mean, this is really. It's not a comet. Okay, it's not a comet. It is covered with something, but um, who's? It, it, I'm gonna tell you right now. It's it's a. It was a vehicle that transforms and yes, it's got a dirt like substance on it, but apparently somebody knew that when you send things through space, it needs to be covered. The earth's covered. Other planets mm -hmm. are covered. This thing's covered too. Check this out. I'm going to show you. I've been discovering how a lot of this thing moves. Now I know you think I'm crazy, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm going to show you how it gets these different shapes. Some of them. bring it. Okay. See that it's got a, we basically got a bucket in defector on a uh, we, we've got a uh, we've got a swivel point points of rotation we've got cables pulleys all sorts of things now watching the bottom right hand corner now um there's uh physical stops on this thing and watch the bottom i'm gonna show you how the legs fold up i found the, the joints on it watch this now let's move in for a close-up I'm not going to say, I haven't found probably nearly all of the parts on this machine that move because they're hiding a lot of it, but I have found some of it. Look at this. See that wow. point of rotation? I didn't put that yep. on there. It's on there. See the physical stops and everything? Mm -hmm. It's a little bit of trouble. I didn't just guess on all of this. And here, here's the way the legs basically fold up right like that. Oh, I know I'm crazy. Well, you know what? This thing gets better. How does it go from that to this? It's morphing. Well, it is. Watch this. See that? It's a point of yep. rotation. And right there is another one back behind that piece. You can't see it. That is a jaw. That's what it does right there. I know it's crazy. It looks like a giant Pac-Man or, or T-Rex. They got... I don't know what this machine did or does. I feel like it's defunct. I think it's running through space. 
out of control and it's still changing shape. I, but why else would they even let the ESA send a probe to it? They would even get close if it was still functioning. Mm -hmm. let, me, let me bring this in close and you can see everything's there. You know about mechanics. It's all there. Now, what else does this wow. thing do? This is the same machine. Look at this. Same comment. I'm sorry. <laughs> 67p is what we call it. I don't know if I said that. We actually call it 67p. Now watch this along the bottom. Look, look at these. If you look, you can see, kind of highlighted there, you can see these mechanical parts on it. They've kind of mm -hmm. hidden it, but not completely. Now watch this area. That's right. <laughs> you know anything about robotics? I'm going to tell you. This yeah. thing, yeah, this thing has got. It's actually got the, it's got the axes on it. Uh, we call J one, two, three, four shoulder, elbow, wrist rotation, and an end effector. Whatever it does, I don't know. This is some creepy stuff, man. Very creepy. There is a hook right there that I found. <laughs> uh, somebody has li likened this to um, the Egyptian beetle mythology. Uh, there was some beetle worshiping or something going on. There's a guy that's been sending yeah. stuff on it, says this looks very much like it. Well, I think they went through several things um, with this object. You know, I, I got a lot of stuff like this. You know, we sit here all night and be showing you this stuff. And, and I, I promise everybody, I actually, I actually didn't um, spend my whole life looking for this stuff. I just, I get some free time and I, I find it and I, I see it pretty quick pretty sure mm -hmm. about this. Um, it's, it's a transformer, man. I don't know what else to say. Yeah.